of God. The words of our 16th president, Abraham Lincoln. He also stated that the Almighty directly makes use of human agencies and directly intervenes in human affairs is one of the plainest statements of the Bible. It was George Washington, our first president, who affirmed, no people can be bound to adore and acknowledge the invisible hand which conducts the affairs of men more than the people of the United States. <clears throat> and it was Thomas Jefferson who gave us these immortal words. God who gave us life gave us liberty. Can the liberties of a nation be secure when we have removed the conviction that these liberties are a gift from God? Our own Declaration of Independence implores us for the support of this Declaration with a firm reliance on the protection of the Divine Providence. We mutually pledge to each other our lives, our fortunes, and our sacred honor. Righteousness exalts a nation, but sin is a disgrace to any people. Blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord. Blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord, who rests within his promises. Kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. 